African leaders meeting in Ethiopia's capital Addis Ababa on Thursday told South Sudan's President Salva Kiir and opposition leader Rek Machar they need to act urgently to bring peace to their country. The meeting had been billed by regional leaders as a step towards ending a five-year-old civil war that has killed tens of thousands of people and forced more than three million to flee their homes in the world's youngest country. It is the first time since 2016 that regional leaders were able to bring Kieran Machar together for talks when a peace deal collapsed and fighting re-erupted between their forces. Regional leaders from the Intergovernmental Authority on Development were joined by the Africa Union Chairman and the United Nations Special Envoy for South Sudan and Sudan with an aim to bring peace to the region. We all have said enough is enough. We all have vowed never again. Now the time for promise is over. We need to act and time is not on our side. We urge all parties at this point to stretch for an agreement in the interests of the South Sudan people. However, I should caution that the international community will actively support an agreement only if it is sustainable and implementable. The conflict in South Sudan cannot be allowed to drag on, inflicting further deaths and destruction as agreements break down. The war broke out in 2013, less than two years after oil reached South Sudan, gained independence from Sudan. Now, opposition leader Rek Machal will travel to Khartoum on Sunday to attend another meeting with President Salva Kiir.